When it comes to balance, what do you hear from your clients? Sure. I think that so many women I work with are in the mothering years. And I think we are so grateful to have opportunities. But one thing that's become very evident to me is that there's no roadmap for women who are trying to navigate growing their career and raising a family. And it can just be overwhelming at times. Also with working from women ranging from CEOs to stay at home moms and everyone everywhere in between, many women feel like they're just in a constant water hose of reacting to other people's needs, be it family, community, workplace. And they've really lost that sense of like, whoa, who am I? What do I stand for? And like, how am I showing up in life that feel in a way that feels for me and intentional and nourishing? And so I also think that a lot of women who are in this age range are carrying something major, caring for a sick kid, caring for an ailing parent, dealing with a husband who's lost um, his job. And so these women are just really going through a lot. So balance is hard. Do you find that there's some uh, insights you have now that are helpful to them to get that balance? This is a great question. There's so many ways I could go, but I feel like there's a lot of women who are waking up to the truth that it's okay to press pause, even on certain aspects of your life that you thought were fulfilling and aren't anymore and trust that you can come back to things. Mm -hmm. I think that there's a lot of women who are recognizing the power of slowing down and kind of making sure that they didn't just get on this hamster wheel of life and completely lose their autonomy. I think that a lot of women are realizing that when they're falling in bed at night and they're exhausted and dissatisfied, that they've just been chasing the to-dos without really realizing that what they're doing isn't lined up with their bigger purpose or their values. And they're waking up for this to this and they're ready to actually take a little bit more responsibility and for their own life and living out their purpose. And a lot of that starts with just being able to slow down and introspect and start saying no to things, which are all things that take time. 